Hello, 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 and welcome back, guys and girls, to some more Tales of Hysteria on the PlayStation 4. Also, this game can be picked up surprisingly on the PC and also on the PlayStation 3. Continuing on from where we last left off, our objective is right here. Talk to the girl and get started on her preparation. We need to actually craft um, some sort of bag, which we'll do right now. And uh, yeah, looking forward to this. Hopefully, this game does have Ready? some sort of crafting system. Um, honestly, I don't really know too much about this game. I kind of like left it a secret for myself. Uh, but here we are, so far so good. So, what do you need me to do? Sorry for putting you to work like this. Oh, I'm pretty used to it. With your help, I'll be able to leave tomorrow. Thanks so much. Yeah? Great. Well, better rest up for tomorrow. I ought to let Gramps know. Wish I'd asked her more about the world below. So we can we consume the prickle ball hide. Um, the reason why I do think there's going to be some sort of crafting system is because we have to actually gather the like um, materials to craft that. I'm not really sure how it works in this game, but. Hopefully, we'll find out a little bit more about it pretty soon. This is actually the wrong house. Gramps' house is right over here. And we, may, we may actually find Miklio here. I hope so. He's a cool guy. Let's see what we got. Wait, his house is a lot bigger than ours. This is kind of unfair. Now he looks tiny. Gramps, why does he look so tiny? Hey, Gramps. She says she's leaving tomorrow. I see. We'll all be sure to see her off. After all, one must always be hospitable to one's guests. Thanks. Thanks. <laughs> That's like the weirdest smile you'll ever see. It's gotta be his eyebrows, he just makes him look super weird. I really owe you. Thank you so much. You gonna be okay by yourself? I cannot cause more trouble for you than I already have. I see. <sighs> you'll be fine. Just follow that map and you'll get through the forest with no problems. Oh, it's not that. I believe you. Alicia. Alicia. Huh? That's my name. That's my name. Alicia Difta. Alicia? Alicia? You didn't even know who I was. And you helped me without asking anything in return. Whereas I thought only of myself, leaving you without even a name by which to call me. As a knight, I am ashamed. Please find it in your heart to forgive me. It's okay. I must confess something to you. Hmm? I know this sounds strange, but I believe that the Seraphim really do exist. The myths and legends that are preserved in the Celestial Record must be more than mere fairy tales. Yeah. This crisis that has befallen our world. I believe only the ones spoken of in the ancient legends can truly restore order. The Shepherd, you mean? You're not going to ridicule me? Everyone back in town does. Of course not. You're a real saint, you know that? The Sacred Blade Festival is soon to commence in Lady Lake. A trial will be held based on the legend of the Shepherd's Sword. A trial I think you might be interested in. Me? Time to go. But please, give it some serious thought when you have the time. How come? The shepherd I see in my mind when I read the legends. I have to say, he reminds me a lot of you. <sighs> What's this? Gramps asked me to go out and search the ruins and find some clues about that girl. I've been down there looking. So wait, this is Alicia's? This is the crest of Highland. I don't think this Alicia is any ordinary knight. I know this is difficult for you, but it really is for the best. Gramps? Hmm. Someone has infiltrated my domain. 
Blast in damnation! Hide in your presence, are you, crafty bugger? Everyone, be warned! There is an intruder in our realm! Find them! They've concealed their presence! So chances are good, it's a Hellion! Search with extreme caution! We'll go too. Very well. If it is a Hellion, quick measures must be taken. I'm counting on you. I have a hunch we'll find it around the forest. Good idea. They can look after themselves and anyway, Gramps will keep him safe. We need to go to the forest. If I was going to hide anywhere, that would be the first place I'd try. So Hellions, we actually came across Hellions very, very early on into the game. Um, like within the first five or ten minutes. Um, apparently they can only be defeated with purification, so we have to be extra extra cautious of them. We were actually advised to just run if we came across them, but it looks like we need to actually um, make the first moves ourselves here, so let's get on the search. Do you know what? I actually kind of feel to remove the objective marker, because it does make things quite um, on the easy side, I do actually like to explore myself. It just feels a lot more rewarding. But um, I guess if things do actually become a little too easy, then I'll definitely look into that. I know the battles will actually become a lot more intense and a lot more difficult. But where the hell am I going? Is this the right? Okay, maybe we should actually drop, go around the other side here. How odd. I didn't expect to find anything but the main course here. But now there's two more side dishes. What on earth is this thing? Is this the Hellion? This is not the place for one such as you. Leave at once. <laughs> Impudent brat! I can smell the fear wafting off of you, those tender arms trying to conceal their shivers. Saray! Mmm. Aren't you a succulent treat? What? What? Did I stutter? I'm saying I'm going to eat you! As if! I can take you! Prepare to meet your doom, Hellion! Alright, set heavily torrent on the arts menu and unleash the hidden art with X. On the arts menu. Alright, so this like was actually assigned already. So perform hidden arts with X. Uh, combos combining with martial uh, combos combining both martial and hidden arts are possible. For instance, you can use a hidden art to target an enemy's weakness before following up with a martial art. You can set up to five in arts in combination with, <laughs> with the left analog in the arts menu. If you have nothing set in the top slot, present X will let the system choose from any of your learned hidden arts. Oh, we should actually overuse those because it does actually consume. But uh, it's still really cool, I think if we only got the one art. So if I use the direction and the X button, it does actually do nothing for you. So, just X for now. But yeah, it's pretty, really cool. You can, you can actually combine it with uh, martial arts. I mean, it has been the same for all um, Tales games, but always a nice feature. So I'm more into the. I mean, I do love turn based games as well. But uh, it's just something about this system I just really, really love. Can't talk, aren't you? Still haven't had enough yet? Be gone! Mason! He... He ate Mason! Is... Is this what Hellions are capable of? Away with you, evil being! Or you want to take us all on at once? Hmm. I shouldn't be snacking anyway. Not when the main course is getting away. Wait, do you think he's after the girl? Alicia? Mason. Mason. 
We can handle the rest. Gramps, that fox-looking thing. Was that really a Hellion? They can talk to us? Yes. That's the form of a human who has become a Hellion. Corrupted, essentially. Humans can become Hellions? Now, it's time you went back home and rest. We should. Come on, let's head back. Right. So, it begins anew. did it come here to do? How odd. I didn't expect to find anything but the main course here. <sighs> Not when the main course is getting away. Wait a minute. Was it going after her? So before before we do proceed any further, we're gonna quickly um, check the arts list here. Automatic. So this would just be the X button on its own. Uh, used nine times. It's a decent move. In an arc com comprised of an upward slash in a style reminiscent of one challenging a waterfall's torrent so yeah we won't have it automatic we'll just leave it as it is um strike and fang yeah slightly complicated i'm just trying to all right looks like everything's set already i don't think we've actually got any other moves uh, available to us um equipment support talents um, I guess we could actually change titles. Uh, I'm not entirely sure how that's done. Um, yeah, don't really have to <laughs> look into this too much. So, snack preparation, point of interest detection. Make snacks recover HP while on the move. Each character has their own technique and specialties. Raise level to increase number of item types and preparation speed. Uh, this one detect previously undiscovered monoliths and this, okay, this one's pretty useful, I guess. Uh, and we can't actually equip both at the same time, so I guess we'll stick to this one. Eventually, I'm pretty sure we'll be able to to have more than one. But uh, fashion, okay, cool. We can actually uh, customize our characters. Look, unfortunately, we don't we do not have anything. As of yet, we have a hat style we could go with. Mm, pretty cool, but I think I prefer his original young man's haircut. It's just got more of that Japanese anime kind of male protagonist look to it. And we've got our, reg our regular clothes, so we'll leave it as that. I'm always messing around with, with, with um, settings, but yeah, it looks like we're... Wait, where are we actually heading? Are we going back into the forest? Uh, leave the village for... The oh, what the? For the land below? Jeez, this guy's crazy. Saray, you're one crazy dude. At least ask Mikleo to come with us. But he'd probably be against it, so. He'll probably freak out with me gone suddenly. Sorry, everyone. Yeah, we can understand why Gramps worried about him. He's he's kind of um He's too helpful. He's an honest guy. He's a good guy. But um he's literally gonna get himself killed. Well he's not gonna get himself killed, he's gonna get himself into deep trouble. And we've got a safe spot here, another monolith. I just saw a monolith written in ancient tongue. Oh, so it is that ancient tongue. I was calling it tongue earlier, tongue. 
So I was actually wrong. I, well, I was right, and then I corrected myself. Um, and yeah, it's actually tongues. But yeah, it appears to be a wisdom uh, targeting. It usually just gives you like a tip. Uh, press up with a few more de details about them. And um, you're literally just here for the AP. The tips are, are pretty basic. Well, they have been basic so far. But here we go. I was wondering where this led to. It's actually the exit. Okay. Oh. Whoa! Miklio! Why are you here? Thought I'd let you duck out of here. Well, I'm going to. Seriously? We can talk more while we travel. We don't have time. But from what the Foxman said, it's fair to assume that he's after Alicia. You picked up on that too, huh? Of course. Now, yeah, I let's hurry. Yeah, I as well. Hey! What? What's gotten into you all of a sudden? I'm just... Really happy you came with me. I couldn't let you navigate the world of humans alone. Not as guileless as you are. I bet Gramps is mad, though. He was ready for it, in a way. He knew you'd leave someday. Hey, I'm just stepping out for a bit. I'll see him again. Gramps has always known. That once you left, you'd live the rest of your days with humans. Is this from Gramps? We'll need money to get by in human society. He said to sell that if we're ever in a bind. Uh. And there's a message for you as well. Walk the path you believe in, and live your life to the fullest. And I know you will not go astray. That's what he said. Let's go. That's some inspirational stuff right there, guys. By themselves, people are such frail things. That is why, in times of calamity, they pray for a ship to save. <laughs> this is really it! This is our world! The era, later known as the Age of Chaos, gave birth to a new shepherd. This is his story.
All right, that was a pretty sweet intro. After we get through the forest, we should reach the lake. Then we just have to head down the slope. Got it. But wait a minute. How do you know all this? It's not complicated. I've been collecting information for this very day. On your own? You never told me about it. <laughs> yeah, so what did you guys think of the intro? I was kind of surprised by the music choice, but still, that was pretty cool. I mean, the more it went on, the more I was enjoying it. And uh, would this actually work here? Oh, it does work. Cool. Uh, four life balls. We actually found quite a few life balls now, but we are pretty much prepared for this long awaited journey. Another chest. Too close by. Don't mind that. Battle boots. Unisex boots customized for combat. We've literally given every um, equitable item to Saray here, so maybe we should give this one to Miklio. I mean, he does deserve it. He did come with us. Okay, it's definitely not going to work here, is it? No, that gives us no indication of what we need to actually get past that. I mean, I'm just waiting for the enemies. There's got to be some enemies around this somewhere. I say that like I'm actually looking forward to the enemies. Snacks are done. Chocolate gelato. Kind of hungry now. All right, I'm gonna really throw these boots on. Um, we'll give them to him to make Leo. Sharon is Karen. Yeah, you've literally, give, you've literally given everything to to Saray. Uh, no need to actually work on, I mean, we can't work on Alicia right now. But eventually we'll have to. Lake Haven Heights. But yeah, just in case you don't know, you can actually switch out characters. Like, if you want to play with Miklio, you can do so. I don't feel Gramps' domain anymore. That's because we've left the forest. Our adventure officially starts here. First off, we need to find Alicia and let her know she's being targeted. And then, we'll take down that fox guy. It's best we avoid confrontation with Hellions as much as possible. But... I want to avenge Mason just as much as you do. But we're just a Seraph and a human. Neither of us with any power to purify malevolence. Never mind defeating him. Whether we could even drive him off by ourselves is iffy. And we can't rely on Gramps' assistance anymore. You're right, Mick Leo. Alright, wise words. I'm uh, gonna quickly really save up. Uh, I don't think I'm gonna wrap things up as of yet, but I will wrap things up pretty shortly. Um, but here we are. No more Gramps' presence. A skit. We haven't had too many skits so far. But uh, I'll try and actually play every skit possible. I mean, I usually do anyway. I feel bad just for missing one, but yeah, we try and get all of them, uh, which I actually notice. I mean, you, you can miss them. They usually pop up on the screen, you need to actually activate them yourselves. Uh, they're not automatic or anything. And uh, they're, they're only there for a limited time, so. Yeah, you gotta be quick. Shoot, a wolf. Alright, quick step. We know the quick step. A wolf? No, it's a hellion! It'll attack once it gives chase. Alright, quick step is easy. Can pop the combo? They can use them in literally any direction. So uh, you got R1 to change your target. Holding R1 brings up this little menu. Press the circle button, brings up the help. Gives you a little description of your character. A wolf, we don't find these around. Um, it's a little easier. It does sound familiar from another Tales game also. Yeah, we'll make it work. You know what? I think we can't believe we'd run into a hell right, so all of a sudden. It was, it was cool again. Quite strange. I hope it's just a coincidence. Could it be I'm attracting them because they know I can see them? Who can say? It's too early to tell. Man, see, I don't, I don't want to miss out on anything in this, uh, in this, in this area. So if you see me like running around <laughs> in like awkward directions it's because I'm trying to find everything Central Lake Haven Heights uh, Lookout Rock 
completely like what's your step all right let me quickly check something is this when you need to watch our step look there's the lake and there's a huge city let's go check it out Right, hidden arts can overpower an enemy's martial arts. So when an enemy comes up to you with a series of troublesome martial arts, try carrying with your own series of hidden arts. On the other hand, hidden arts take more time to cast and consume more SC. To fully master them, you need to consider when and how to, to utilize them best. Cool. I never actually use too, too many of the hidden arts in, in the Tales games. I usually just use... Uh, um, Martial arts, to be honest, that's kind of like Focus, guys. all me. Ready? Strike. Damn, what's going on? Oh, it actually really wants us to change target, Ready? okay. Strike. Oh, so no this damage is going to be dealt until we change the target, okay, cool. Holding down R1 to confirm your target. While doing this, you can also switch targets using. Up left hand dog, tap L1. Couldn't have been a coincidence. They're attracted to us somehow. All right, we're here. Sorry for that little pause, guys. I'm still here, and here we are. We're here. <laughs> now I really feel like I'm actually in another world. It's great to have a field trip and all, but try not to get us lost, please. <laughs> we'll be just fine. I got us a map! Oh, you mean the one that's in the Celestial Record? It's kinda old though. I'll probably need to redraw parts of it as we go along. You can now view the world map by pressing R3 outside of battle. From here, you can view map information such as elements... So, oh, not elements, such as enemies appear in which area. Alright, so this map I assume is gonna be different to the touchpad map. Shops, inns, towns. Wait, what did I just do? Oh, cool. Uh, dungeons. So I wonder if there's um, like a fast travel system here. Damn, we missed it. Focus, guys. Issue commands to everyone. Watch for the pauses between attacks. It's amazing how they can move without arms and legs. Command the whole party with the right analog. Um, we'll override any strategy. Charge forward, which is attack. Spread out to the left. Focus attacks. Prioritize the defense. Okay, we'll go all out attack here. And you click Just it for cancellation of commands. Alright, that's pretty cool. Yeah, for putting this up to we get this, it's probably um, useful just to go all out attack. No, really cool to we managed to escape for now. Change of control. Right, yeah, I guess once we come up, yeah. Some kind of trouble? Looks like it. The cart stopped. I was literally gonna say when we come up. When we come across our next save point, that's when we'll wrap things up. So we're going to wrap things up here, guys and girls. Uh, hopefully you did enjoy this one. Okay, I guess we can't wrap things up as of yet. We'll see what's going on here. But now we can wrap things up. Thank you once again for joining me in this episode. I hope you are enjoying the series so far. I'm not entirely sure how much this game I will be uh, recording for you guys. But um, if it goes well... 
I mean, I'll keep it coming your way. I'm just giving you guys like a first kind of like look at things. Cause I did actually get this game two game two, two days early, and I thought I might as well try and get as much footage um, on YouTube as possible. So once again, thank you for watching, and I guess I'll see you all in the next video. See ya.